anti-accident fruit lovers. Today I wanted to do a video about how to clean organic strawberries or any strawberries really. If you've noticed the social trend right now, there was a video that went viral on TikTok about how to properly wash strawberries. I'll link to this post on Facebook um, in the about section below, but I covered up her name just in case um, she ends up wanting to make it private or something like that. So in order to clean them, you need one part white vinegar, four parts cold water, sprinkle with salt and let sit five minutes. So I'm gonna do, She. I, I also read the comments of this post and a lot of people didn't understand what four parts versus one part was. So I'm gonna put four cups of cold water into this dish and then one cup of white vinegar. So that's four parts, one part and then I'll sprinkle with salt. So here's the four parts four parts of water, one part of vinegar, and then I'm gonna use a salt shaker. All I have is seasoned salt or Himalayan sea salt, so we'll use that one. I think on another post that I watched, you're supposed to let the salt disintegrate. So you can barely see it, but if I just stir it around a bit, maybe I can, sorry for the noise. Okay, now it's pretty much disintegrated. I'm not gonna eat all these strawberries tonight, so I'll probably just do half of them. And now we will wait five minutes. All right, it has been well over five minutes, so I'll remove the strawberries. All right, supposedly, on the TikTok, it showed that all the stuff that's left is bugs. Um, but the one that I saw on TikTok was a video and the bug was actually moving. Any movement that you see right now is the water still settling down. I don't even see bug movement on the strawberries. And then here are those little pieces that are inside the bottom of the bowl which again, don't appear to be moving. It could just be my hand at this point. So I actually wonder if these strawberries were already rinsed clean, um, you know, by the person that packaged them up, by the company that packaged them up because I'm not seeing any bugs. And there they are all cut up and ready to eat. I really don't think that there are bugs on these. Um, I wonder if it has to do with where you're sourcing your strawberries from. I got these strawberries from natural grocers. They only carry organic produce, which you'd think would have more bugs, but they could have been pre-washed. Um, and then the lady that posted this also said that they, uh, they taste a lot better after they've been cleaned. It almost like brings out the flavor in them. So I'll continue to do this, but I really haven't seen any bugs or any moving parts in all of this. I gotta be honest, I'm glad I haven't seen any moving parts because I didn't know if I'd be able to eat the strawberries afterwards, although I'm sure I've eaten a ton of bugs in my life. Also wanted to add, these are the tops of the strawberries that I will put outside for the birds and the squirrels. Um, I've found recently that birds really like apples. The robins in my backyard will eat apples all day long. So um, that's what I like to do with these scraps and wanted to share if that would help anybody else. If you've tried this method of washing strawberries in four parts cold water, one part vinegar, please share it in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and we'll see you next time.